Continues with certified meteorologist Laura Mock. She's live in Columbus, Texas with conditions there. Well, when we got into Columbus this morning, the waters were already rushing through town. Keep in mind, the Colorado River, which is the source of all of this water backing up into the town, is about a mile away, and we can still see the water behind me rushing by very quickly. A lot of people have been comparing it to Tropical Storm Allison or even the tax day floods, but what they're saying is this is probably worse, the worst they've ever seen, worse than uh, those two events. Um, what we're also seeing is here in the last hour, that water has, I'd estimate, come up about a foot. Um, we ran into some uh, ranchers, some farmers in the area. We watched as they herded their cattle down the main highway in town to get their cows to higher ground. Uh, one farmer we spoke with says he knows there will be some cows that just won't be saved, but it's not risking your life for. With the river coming up, there's uh, the water just spreading out so much is catching some people with uh, cattle in different areas that uh, with, it's never been this high for most people that are alive now. And cows aren't the only wildlife looking for higher ground. We've seen possums cross the road just trying to find a place to go. Deer stuck in the middle of rising water. Definitely a dangerous situation. One thing else that we watch, which I'm going to bring to you in the next half hour, is a rescue of an entire apartment complex. That was just across the creek here. The apartments were becoming surrounded. We're, we'll bring you that story coming up. Reporting in Columbus, Texas, I'm meteorologist Laura Mock.